And here is the transcript for the second video. So the video that you are going to be taking data on. So now that we practice taking data, we want to understand what exactly we do with the data. So it's important that we take the data so we understand if the interventions that we put in place using the social script are working or not. However, it's really important that we also review it so we can create smarter goals for our students. So some things to consider are, has the learner transferred the script to more than one person? And has the learner transferred the script to more than one setting? So as the learner starts to utilize the social script, we wanna make sure that they're also generalizing so that they're able to actually use that skill outside of just the classroom. So here are some resources you can use to help create social scripts that work. So we use symbol sticks um, or board maker at Project Access. So it is something I believe you have to pay for. So if you, again, are having a hard time building a social script by yourself, feel free to reach out to us or check our website because we might be able to help you there. Um, you can go to this linked website for simple social scripts and many flipbooks. You can make social scripts on taking turns, greetings, what happens when you feel frustrated, or asking for help. So there's tons of different ways you can implement social scripts. It doesn't always have to be um, to target skill acquisition or behavior change. However, it is an evidence-based practice that you can use. So that's the whole point of this whole workshop is that we walk away feeling confident in our knowledge about social scripts and how we can use them with our learners. And again, here are some more resources you can use for um, social scripts. So I would like to open the floor for any questions or comments. I know that we can't necessarily do that in person because this is an online workshop, but you do have my contact information. So if you were listening to this or you got to this point and you have a question that went unanswered, feel free to um, call me or shoot me an email. And this is your reminder to now complete the post test. So again, I know I kind of harped on it in the beginning, but it's really important that you complete all components of this workshop to receive your certificate. And keep in mind that certificates are manually um, submitted, so you will have to wait a couple of days before receiving that certificate. But you need to make sure that you complete the pretest, the assignments, and then also the post test. And you have to pass all of those things to receive your um, certificate. So this is just your last reminder to complete those things. And then the link to the course evaluation or feedback form will be um, linked in your Blackboard as well. And if I haven't mentioned it enough, please check out our website for different training opportunities. If you have professional development or you would like your staff trained over different topics dealing with autism, we will come and do that for you free of cost. And then you can also check out our free resources and our other online workshops that might be beneficial to you or other coworkers in your district. And then here is project access contact information. I just wanna thank you again for taking this scripting workshop. I really appreciate your time and effort and I really hope that this was beneficial in creating social scripts that work.